Hello. I think it was four months ago that I did a reaction video to a teaser trailer and the film in question was Joker. I've just found out that a day ago, it, one day ago, the final, the final trailer dropped. So I'm going to do a reaction to it now. So here it goes. Oops. Alright, usually I could cast this to the television, but I don't have the cast symbol. So I'm going to have to go to the TV and do it manually. So I'm just going to pause this now. And unpause. Right, I've got the film all ready. I'm about to press play. Let's take off the mute. Alright, we're ready. And off we go. every week. How's your job? Are you having any negative thoughts? All I have are negative thoughts. And finally, in a world where everyone thinks they should do my job, check out this guy. When I was a little boy and told people I was going to be a comedian, everyone laughed at me. <laughs> well, no one's laughing now. You can say that if you have fun. It's so awful, isn't it? For my whole life. That was different to the teaser because throughout the teaser back in February, four months ago, I guess it was May, the song was Charlie Chaplin's uh, Smile and it really had an impact. This is completely different but still good. That was an old Bob Monkash joke there where he, where he said, um, Everybody laughed when I first said I wanted to be a comedian. Well, they're not laughing now, are they? <laughs> that was a classic Bob, Bob Moncast joke. But, um, yeah, it's, it's, it's such a different trailer. I mean, the music in this one was more of a s score, the film score. But then you heard Bring On The Clowns at the end. Wow, I have some bad news, Arthur. And that laugh. I mean, the laugh last time was was bang on, but this one was this. I ooh, I felt a chill just listening to that laugh. Wow, so that film comes out in October what, in America. Yeah, that looks really good. I'm looking forward to seeing that film when it comes out. Yeah, very good. Wow. So I saw a bit more of Robert De Niro this time, doing his Rupert Pupkin, or if Rupert Pupkin became a presenter. Yeah, wow, that is one good film. 
But if I'm honest, I prefer the teaser. The teaser really, because of that song, Smile, and him jumping down the steps at the end. That was such a, whew, a roller coaster teaser. This one has crammed in, it's just as long. I think the teaser was 2 minutes 20. This is 2 minutes 20, I believe. But the, this is more, this has crammed a lot in. There's more, we've learned more about his counseling. It's hard to uh, see where the film's going. Obviously, he's been um, subjected to insult and negativity, and now he's he's sort of snapped. And he's going to uh, hit, fight, you know, um, strike back. Wow, well, I don't know. It's it does look good. It's still a bit gappy here and there. Um, yes, yeah, a lot of it says trailer, so it's hard to say really put my hand on my heart I'd say the teaser was had more of an impact this one was completely different I want to like it I do want to see it but on the trailer alone I it seems to I'm trying to convince myself to like it and I'm, I'm struggling I'm struggling I keep thinking that the teaser was so powerful this this trailer it doesn't it's not powerful. It doesn't have that emotion. It's become crazy, but not doesn't have an emotion. I didn't care for the trailer. I watch it again, and I'll tell you how I feel. I see you shortly. Right, I'm back again. I've seen the trailer again, and on the second viewing, it does have an emotional punch. Yes. Um, it is different but it's equally powerful I thought uh, I was disappointed last time because of the teaser it, it's so different to the teaser but this one does, is quite powerful all he has is negative thoughts yes it's, uh, it's very good it's a very good it looks like a very good film I'm, I'm excited for it of course be it's a tra it's a trailer you, you want to know what it's about and we you don't want to know what it's about because if you know what it's about and you've, you've seen all the best bits in the trailer then you, you're not going to make the effort to see it now I'm puzzled by it, I'm excited by it that laugh though, oh my god, when he's turning the corner it's like he's practicing, he must be, all around him are clown masks and he's just walking through the corridor and he's is he practicing his laugh because Oh gosh, it's it's just terrifying. I've never heard the laugh like that, you know. And um, it does seem like King of Comedy. How did he get to be on a TV show? What's he done? Who has he kidnapped? Who has he got to kid? Who has he kidnapped somebody close to De Niro's character for De Niro to give him a shot on the show? Just like in King of Comedy, when Jerry, when he did the same to Jerry Lewis, or well, Jerry Lewis was kidnapped by Sandra, Sandra Bernard uh, while he got his shot on his show so it's there's echoes of that and of course when he's running down is it the hospital corridor the way he's running his hair off you know long hair just flopping about it's just it reminds you of uh, Heath Ledger's Joker so yes that's that's that if there's one film I want to see this year for the rest of the year, it's got to be the Joker. It's called Joker. It's not the Joker, it's Joker. Yes. I'm wondering if it's going to turn into a fantasy action film along the lines of DC Comics' Joker. Because um, if it goes down that path, I don't know. I think if we keep it serious with a psychological slant to it, then it's more appealing, more, more intriguing, more exciting. But if it goes into fantasy, along the comics, comics route, I don't know, it could, it could be a disappointment, so I don't know. It, but, on the strength of Joaquin Phoenix's performance, the cinematography, and the turn of the film, if, they, if it's like the teaser, not the trailer, then... But you didn't hear Smile, Charlie Chaplin's smile in this, so 
maybe it was just for the teaser, maybe it's not in the final film. I suppose we'll have to wait and see. But yeah, I'm going to watch it again. Maybe a different person did the trailer to the teaser, because the teaser is really powerful. Anyway, I'll leave a link to the trailer at the end, as well as the teaser. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.